The first time I saw manta rays, I was completely blown away. No photo or video could really compare to what it's like being in these animals' presence. They're curious and friendly. They'll come right up to you and stare into your eyes. Sometimes you can seriously just sit on the bottom in the sand and they just come hover over you. My friend Roberto has dove with them for years. He's even cut fishing line off of some. And it's like they remember him, the ones with the scars from the line. Just see him and swoop down and follow him around. Manta rays face intense issues that we've created. They're filter feeders and are vulnerable to ingesting plastic and rubbish floating at the surface. They're also easily caught as bycatch and entangled in discarded fishing gear. But most of all, they're being hunted and killed for a dish that's falsely pushed as traditional Chinese medicine to a growing number of consumers. To create pangusai, manta rays are caught and their gills are cut out. All for a dish that isn't even considered real traditional Chinese medicine. Manta rays reproduce slowly. They can't keep up with the rate we are wiping them out at. You can help manta rays by participating in responsible ecotourism, especially on islands where manta rays are hunted as the only source of income. This provides fishermen with a more sustainable way of providing income for their families and communities. Giving these animals economic value in the eyes of the government can be monumental in helping better protect them. It's our responsibility to make sure manta rays are around for years to come.